Hey Dollar Tree studs, welcome back to my channel, Confessions of a Dollar Tree Addict. I'm Marina and I'm sure you guys can see the green awning behind me. We are about to hit that Dollar Tree. But before we get into the Floral Park Dollar Tree, I want to let you guys know that I am super excited that you are here with me. And for those of you who are new, I am grateful that you've chosen to subscribe. For those of you who are OGs, thank you so much for sticking with me. And before I get super long-winded, let's get our butts into the Dollar Tree and see what's new and what awesome items we can find. It is crazy crazy windy outside although it doesn't look it it's crazy windy so i'll see you guys on the inside bye guys look at this guys i don't know if you guys can tell the size of it it's humongous really really big full size like coloring book size but it only has 30 coloring pages but you know what i'm saying like full size coloring book size by crayola trolls trolls topia you get four washable markers, really cool, a whole sticker sheet, and you get the 30 coloring pages. I think that this is an amazing $1.25 buy. These are back, and some of my favorite little $1.25 pickups here at the DT, the little drink umbrellas. They're so fun for the summer, and they also have the 200-piece sandwich picks, which are also really fun for poolside snacking, but I actually think it's also cute to put the parasol picks in sandwiches or different types of pool festivities. I just think that they're fun and they're just a buck and a quarter. They're really cute. The cooking concepts, regular toothpicks are 500 pieces, but if you look, you'll see that they're a little bit smaller and it really does make a difference in a sandwich. So it's up to you. I mean, if you make thin like tuna sandwiches on white bread or something like that, this is fine, but these definitely take it up a notch. I wish they had the little plastic curly cues at the end. Those are really fun. Remember those guys? My gosh, as I'm walking away, I found, I can't believe this. I actually didn't know that they had them. They have the ones with the little, I'm actually gonna get these. I love these for sandwiches. These are so fun, guys. I am loving these simple little luxuries that you can find at the DT for a buck 25. Hey, I promise I'm not gonna go down the rabbit hole of plastic bags because the DT has so many lately, it's just too much to deal with. But these say eco-friendly, sustainably made. I don't know what that's about, but they're that bowl roll brand and actually 20 quart sized bags is a good buy and they're sustainably made food grade plastic. Thank God for that. And it says that there's an inner layer of food grade plastic. Hmm. What's the outer layer? Okay. So the outer layer is recycled plastic. Hmm. Okay. I don't. Do you guys know anything about this? Let me know what all of that means because is it bad to put your food in recycled plastic? Is that why the one on the inside is food grade? It's a little confusing, but I mean, I'm sure you guys know. Let me know in the comments down below. <laughs> and now I see these partially made from post-consumer and post-industrial materials. Protecto, recycle, Fortiflex, stronger and flexible tear resistant six bags for a buck 25 wow they're 30 gallon i think that's a pretty good deal guys and they actually feel really heavy these may be a good good buy it says recycle 113 liters i i don't know what the recycle part is it says cleaning process Okay, so it's made out of recycled material. I don't know, lately there's a whole lot of really catchy packaging when it comes to the plastic bags and stuff, and I'm not really sure what we're getting at. Guys, I don't know if this is the kind of thing that makes you happy, but it's the kind of thing that makes me happy. This little thumb tab on the Surefresh container that is sturdier than ever before is wonderful. And I feel like these are absolutely geared for summer fun because look at the colors. We have this gorgeous blue or teal. Then we have this beautiful cobalt blue and this like hot pink, flamingo pink type of color. I think that these are really great, but what I love 
is the thumb tab. Those are awesome for a buck 25 and you're getting three 2.1 cup containers and they're almost like salad shape like scoops of salad i don't know i love them they're really really cool oh they also have the sand uh, see how they taper at the bottom i kind of like that they have the sandwich size ones as well that are 2.25 cups in the gorgeous cobalt blue again the hot pink and the teal and i think i really this is probably my favorite combination of colors they've ever given us and i'm seeing new three pack coffee cups and i love these because although they are reusable they're kind of wonderful because you don't miss them you can always give them out to people when they come over they can take the cup to go and they can reuse it and really it's just so awesome because they're a dollar 25 for three but you can get many, many uses out of them. Just one more cup in the pretty blue. Start the day with gratitude. Again, three cups for a buck 25. This is a multiple cups kind of day and I'm in a sipping state of mind. I really like this one, start the day with gratitude and I love this color. And it is fully stocked when it comes to the patriotic Americana decor. Absolutely beautifully done. Look at everything. Let me just take a step back and give you guys a nice view of all of it. It's really, really good. A lot of the items we've seen before, but not everything. They have two full aisles of 4th of July Americana decor here. Sorry guys, that was the only footage that I was able to get. Although that store is so beautifully stocked, they actually started cranking music so loud that I ended up leaving the Floral Park store and they never play music in there. It was so weird. As you guys can see, we're in West Babylon now and they do have the light up cups that I shared with you guys in my past shop with me. These are amazing. If you have any type of sensitivity to light up stuff, look away, please. But look at these guys, look. Look at how cool for a buck 25, you know how much those cost in a party supply store. They are very, very cool. We saw the runners and we've seen all of this stuff. I do want to say that this glitter star gift box is cool and it's still going. So cool. That cup is awesome. These square plates you get 12 of for $1.25. And then the larger ones that I happen to think are awesome for barbecues. And I love this boom bang pow theme that they brought out this year. It's on the cup. The Boom Bang Pow matches the awesome light up cups. So you can buy a bunch of those light up cups and these and have them at your barbecue. And honestly, you're still going to do cheaper than you would at Party City. Then we have these get your sparkle on cups that are really like necklace cups. You can build little gifts inside of them. Have you guys seen these yet? They're so good. These were so popular last year in the tropical style but they brought them in this year in the 4th of July decor. We've seen all of this goodness, but it's definitely good, guys. I mean, for a buck 25, these are amazing. I did share them all with you, and I love that they have the grow grain ribbon. It just is so complete and wonderful. I am seeing window clings, and I know you guys love to do DIYs with them. I like this guy right here. Isn't he cute? And what about this? It's so 70s. I love it. It reminds me of the Rolling Stones. This one is like a quilt. These window clings are really, really high-end looking. I'm impressed. Those are beautiful. And look at this one. Every pack has a little something special, but that is super cute. So rustic and pretty. And I love the bicycle. Boom, bang, pow. Again, that's kind of like this year's motif. We have the all-American cowboy boots. United we stand. Proud to be an American. We're about to start singing. I'm proud to be an American. And then it has this. Life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. Now, this is super patriotic. 
on the other side here in West Babylon, I am seeing the lemon cups. Now last year I know they had other fruit, but I don't know if they brought them out this year and they're already gone. This is the first sighting. Future me will realize that they did bring back the watermelon and the lemon because I found it in West Islip at the end of this video. And there are some more surprises that I found, but you'll have to wait till the very end to see what they are. I love these. These are, they are super fun and cute and total citrus happiness. Then we have all of those beaded garlands that I did share with you guys in my previous shop with me. We've got the pineapple one that is super duper cute, but I'm not loving the green that they put in it. I feel like I would have liked it more if it was like a limey green. I know it's just me being nitpicky. We have the watermelon, the pink flamingo. My favorite one, absolutely favorite, is the lemon one. And they all have the tassel with the grow grain ribbon added in. I think that that is a really nice touch. They brought back the stirs that we all love for our tall iced coffees. The flamingo, which if they would just make it a spoon or like more of a spork, it would make me super happy. And in the hot pink, then we have the pineapple that does have the spoon. And oh yes, I know there's a cactus. There we go. We love these. I reuse them year after year and I, oh, oh my gosh. Are you guys seeing this? It's the door banner and it is so nice. Look at how vibrant. These are some of the best things DT is pumping out and they are being so DIY'd into so many other cool, cool things. And they do have the grommets. It was a little flimsy. Now that they have the grommets, you could just buy some of those reusable hooks. That is a good addition. Some of the ones that they first made did not have it, but they're actually thinking things through and I'm really impressed. So the top has the string, but the bottom has a way for you to keep them, you know, with a hook or something in the other direction, stabilized wherever you put them outside so they don't blow away. This is a great afterthought and I'm very impressed that they're improving upon themselves. And I love this one. I love the hibiscus. I love this. I am definitely, this is going to be on my door. Then we have Let's Flamingo. Do you guys see that one? So cool. The colors again are super vibrant. I feel like I need all of these. Look at that. That would be cute on my fence in my backyard. Yep. You guys know that I live for summer. I literally live for summer. I don't know what more to say. And this says sweet summer and it is definitely a bright hot pink. <gasps> yeah, I'm, I need all three, they're amazing. And then up here, we have those cool Mai Tai glasses in pink and green and purple, and they are fun. And of course, we've got yellow back there. So if you're having a party, a backyard barbecue, I mean, just a few of these will make the event so fun, guys, for $5. Not every guest even needs one, just a few, maybe just you. You're the hostess after all. And then goblet with flower decor, Yes, thank you. Those are fun, absolutely fun to have at your backyard party. They do also have them in the pink. And on the box, it shows that there's a difference between these two colors, but maybe they already sold out of them. I'm not seeing them today, but that doesn't mean we won't see them in your Dollar Tree or they the have one. the fruit drink markers in the six pieces. These are cool, guys, because this is how you can keep tabs on whose drink is whose and you get six for the buck and a quarter they brought back their fishnet and people love this for crafting it also comes in the neutral i'm also seeing this and this is very very exciting these are drink pouches you can make like slushies in here in your freezer and take them with you on the go that would be really fun i'm seeing this flamingo pattern you get six of them and they give you the straws. I feel like this is such a fun item, but I also, also see them. seeing this pattern and I love how it matches the sweet summer and you can really blend all of the summer stuff in. If you use these plates in your tablescape, it will be so fun. I'm seeing more of the umbrella picks, but in this one, oh, these are longer. Oh my gosh. Wow, these are cooler than the other ones that I just showed you guys. I love those. Then we have napkins in 
the citrus print that we've seen before, but they brought them back and we always love these. The watermelon, the orange, and the lemon. I mean, you get 16, but they're like a party right, right there. See what I'm saying? Like all of these cool items match this so, so well. I love this because you can really go Again, overboard. I did show you guys this flamingo pattern that matches the other drink cup and they have tablecloths to go with those. But this matches this one, the drink pouches, and of course you can mix and match. They have the Let's Flamingle reusable milk jug looking cup that they bring in every year. And they have this one with the parrots and it says, hello summer. And they brought in, oh my gosh, this one has strawberries all over it, sweet summer. I mean, all of them are just a little bit different. And it looks like these are the only two. I'm not sure if there are others. I see Sweet Summer and Tropical Vibes. And I actually love this. I really like it. That is really, really cute. Wow, look at the napkins. 25 napkins of Sheer Flamingo Joy. I'm in awe of, oh, what? These look like they are from Target Opal House collection, don't they? I'm so Dollar Tree, you are really impressing me with some of the patterns. I love this, of course, because it's just super fun, but this is so cool and like high end. Then we have this Hello Summer. All of them are 25 napkins for that buck 25. And then I'm seeing this Sweet Summer. I mean, guys, guys, this is just fun in a box. What is this? Oh, a flag banner with that cool tropical print. Oh my gosh, there is so much stuff. We are going broke. We're going broke this summer, but we're going to be happy. They have this swirl decoration, and I also see this one with the sweet treats that says sunny days or the hibiscus, like I said. I don't know if they have another banner. Oh, they do. That one with the fun pink, orange, ombre looking print, but I'm really digging this one. It's very Opal House. They have shot glasses that you could actually buy now and use them year round at any event that you're having because they are nicer than any kind that the Dollar Tree normally sells. And they're perfect for your party. You get 24 of these. You could even use these in your bathroom for your mouthwash. They are a good buy because they're just fun colors. Then we have this hanging decoration my gosh, that is really cool too. They also brought in a lemon, really gorgeous. You know what, they've never made this before. And a flamingo. Are you guys seeing the flamingo? It's my favorite. These are actually really worth the money. Things like this are ridiculous on Party City website. It's just absurd to pay anything more than $1.25 because the Dollar Tree's got us covered. When it comes to party supplies, they know what they're doing. This, they even have a pineapple in the back. I mean, they thought of everybody and everything. These are just so good. Everything here all can mix together and you can have the most festive party. Look at this centerpiece. It's pretty huge, guys and nice and well it's a big it's a good size for a buck 25 definitely a really good size and they also have a watermelon looking one oh wow that's fun and they have two different shades of pineapple they've got this blue and gold one with greens that's so pretty and like pink and gold it has foil these are really fancy and if you're not into wearing the big floral summer lace you could always just be a little bit um minimalistic by rocking these 30 inch necklaces you get three in each pack for a buck 25 they kind of love them <laughs> they're like jewelry they come in the pretty pretty blue i like the sound that they make you can almost you know what you could do you can make those door things out of them i love this sound they also have the hot pink the green and of course I love the orange one. I love it. I love the sound they make. I really feel like this. I hope somebody does something with these and makes like wind chimes out of them or something. They have a really satisfying ASMR quality to them. Then I am seeing the table runners are back. They have the pineapple ones, the ones that are made of felt, the monstera plant one, which is very nice, and the hot pink fabulous one of hibiscus. These are just so fun and there's so much to choose from guys absolutely amazing we've seen all of these before 
And that is not it, guys. There's so much more. And this is just the beginning. We already saw the aloha and the relax, but I'm seeing this humongous. I'm gonna pull them away because it's so bright and sunny. Do you guys see this? jointed cutout it's huge 36 inches this is fun for a party or for your wall if you want to transform maybe your garage into the luau spot this is perfect to put inside and make it tropical i love this 36 inches for a buck 25 is a good buy and they also have the 36 inch jointed flamingo which is huge again oh my gosh they also brought in a 29 inch toucan look at that look at how big these are great. If you get them all, you really can transform your garage into a tropical paradise. And a 26 inch pink pineapple. Yes, thank you. Okay, this sign I must have. Hello, summer with the strawberry. I love, I love this sign. It's beautiful. Even the straw is gorgeous. Then we have sweet summertime with the lemons and it's like a Mai Tai glass. I feel like they've, no, this is definitely new. And the glitter, I love everything about it. But this one, it's really really done spectacularly like Hobby Lobby quality. Then we have Happy Summer. And again, guys, they've been putting the signs in the sunlight, so it's kind of hard to see them. So I'm just going to pull it off so you could really get a good look at it. The floral at the bottom and the citrus with the leaf are glittery. And the umbrella has a lot of glitter embellishment. Happy Summer. And then we have this Summer Vibes Pineapple with the hibiscus. It's beautiful too but still my favorite is the strawberry with the mason jar this one is an oldie but a goodie the welcome to paradise i love it i think they might have changed the thickness of it because obviously they're new but they have printed that one out in the past fun in the sun this is nice and thick quality and it has a three-dimensional effect to it I love it. And it has the beads. This is really, really cute as well. And then we have this. Hello, Summer. Loving this as well. The shape is really cute. The beads are really adorable. I love that they have beading added to them. That's really, really nice. Let's see what else they oh have. Oh my gosh. This one is my favorite. Look at this. High tides, good vibes. Do you guys see that? And I like the shape, I think, of this one the most. Wow. These are really, really cool. And it looks like that is it. This one's my favorite because we got, I love the beach, you guys. That's why. And then we have this one, Hello Summer, the flip-flop. We've seen that one before. And the island time. I mean, oh my gosh, guys. Summer days. Look at this. What? This is cute with the flamingo and the pink camper and the flip-flops hanging on the clothesline. What? So, so, this is whimsical. I love it. Then we have this one, Hello Summer, with the gnome and his hibiscus hat. These are really cute too. Then we have this that says welcome. I feel like we had this last year. We have this lemon wedge that says hello summer, summer vibes, watermelon, sunshine of my mind. I mean, it's, it's going to be really hard to decorate because I like all of it. Hello, summer sunshine and chill out. <laughs> okay, and sunshine, summertime. That's really pretty too. The, the rind is all glitter. Simple and cute. I mean, guys, there's so much, so much to choose from that it's really, we're gonna go for broke. And of course, they brought in all of their lays. I actually kind of love these plastic pom-pom lays for some crazy reason. Don't ask me why. Then they have this. This is new. I've never seen it before. It's Monstera plant lays. Do you guys see that? I think that those are cool. Those are like dad lays. <laughs> and then they have flower headbands. Oh, you get several. Look at this. You get six flower headbands for a buck twenty-five. What? These are cool and they stretch. Oh, they could be like choker necklaces. You get flower bracelets, you get 12. What? I don't remember ever seeing this. This is so fun, guys. I don't think they ever had those. I'm kind of loving the flower headbands. Is that crazy? I want to start wearing them as choker necklaces. They're hilarious and I love them. 
Okay, so then we have these 12 pieces. So they have like different color gradients. There's so much to choose from, guys. I know they have the light up ones. I love those too. The adult luau skirt, which people love to wear to parties. And of course, the bikini top. If you have had a couple of Mai Tais and have your courage up, you can put that on. And they made a shell bikini top, which I have a funny feeling people will be making some serious DIYs with. This is pretty cool. I don't remember ever seeing this before. And as we walked in, we saw these, the light up tumblers that look like giant coconut trees. They come in the blue and they come in the pink. And you guys remember them from years gone by. And the pineapple, I happen to love this. I think it is so cool. Light it up at your party. It's cool on the table. It looks like a light up pineapple. Hey Dollar Treestas, we are at the Dollar Tree in College Point, Queens. I haven't been here in a minute. Let's get in there and see what's new, guys. Okay guys, we're in the College Point Dollar Tree and of course, they're playing music in here again. I don't know what that's about, but they've been doing that lately. Now these are for Mother's Day and grandmothers as well. World's greatest, this says world's best grandma. Then we have kisses. Then we have this one. Guys, we're in the College Point Dollar Tree and I see that they've set up a Mother's Day display. They're playing music in here, so I'm not sure exactly what that's about. Every time I come here, there's music playing now. But these are really nice for the buck 25. Do you guys see that? They're mirrored. They look pretty expensive, actually. And then they also have them in this which you can fit a coaster in here. Like you take the picture frame that has the cutout for a four by four and you just plop in a tile. Did you guys know that you could do that? And it looks cute, guys. It's a really good catch-all. Dollar Tree has all different sentiments. Could be a place for you to keep your dog's leash or its collar together, family and love. Perfect. I actually love this one. This is my personal favorite and I like to use it as a spoon rest. It's amazing. This is the exact size of a tile and make a really bougie coaster or something for your vanity. I don't know, but I like this shape. I like this one a lot. They also have these here and these are candle holders. They are not drinking glasses. I actually did a public service video about it because a lot of my subscribers are telling me about these glasses. They are not glasses. And if I was anybody, I would never drink out of anything that the Dollar Tree does not have made for human consuming of food. Do you guys see that? It says candle holder. Lord knows what they painted that with. I do see one of the awesome, oh no, two of the pretty, pretty blue trinket boxes. Those are a hot commodity right now. They have a lot of the beautiful, oh, these are actually, I think, for Mother's Day. They sent them in. So they are making these in, oh, these are actually really nice. They're cotton and raffia. I mean, they've made every combination. We saw those floral golden candlesticks. This I've never seen, always grateful. It's really cute, actually. Then we have stemless wine glasses, fur mama, mom and ain't easy, and super mom, super tired. Yes, thank you. Then we have, I got it from my mama. Are they double-sided? Da, 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 da. Yes, they are. Number one mom. Yes, she is. Home is where mom is. That's so pretty. And best mom ever. Then I'm seeing some stuff for grandma specific. World's best grandma, not double-sided. I don't know if there's anything in there. Then we have this one that says, Grandma shows patience, gives joy, keeps faith, shares, I don't know, wisdom, lives love. Oh, that is so cute. It's really little, but it's really cute. Grandma better get her glasses. Amazing, loving, strong, happy, selfless, and graceful, and it spells mother that way. Home is where mom is. Wonder, let me know in the comments down below if there's anything in there. I'm curious to know. And then I do see some plushies that are left over from Easter. And then, ooh, look at this. This could even be, you guys know that I always just want to make these into trays. 
This is plastic, so you could actually really turn this into, oh, you can make, you can make a really cool lantern out of this because you can put a LED light inside of it. Wow, these are gonna get super DIY'd. I could tell you that right now. And then they also come in this distressed looking black, which is really nice. I actually like these. I think that they're kind of high end looking. And we've seen these puzzle piece picture frames a billion times already, but they busted them out again, like they're new. Let's see what else we have in here today. I kind of like this always grateful. The other side is blank, so maybe you could do something else with the other side, but it does look kind of cool. I wonder if there are others. Oh my goodness, guys, look at this. It's gorgeous. This is exactly what I'm talking about. It is a mirror, it's plastic, it's really sturdy, and you can take this beautiful mirror and you can take this beautiful mirror, hi guys, and you can turn it into a beautiful tray. How gorgeous is that? And they have this gorgeous mirror too. It's really nice. You can probably glue two together and make like a semicircle. I don't know, I'm really excited. I like it when I see the Dollar Tree making mirrors. They only come in black though. Maybe they have others, but I don't see them here. This is absolutely Art Deco amazing. I am in love with this. I'm gonna definitely pick up a few of them. Oh, I only see four. I'm gonna take two of these. College Point Dollar Tree's Americana is amazing. Most of the items on display here we've already seen, but I just had to share how nice this store always looks. It is such a clean, well-stocked store. These are a two-pack, actually they're not, okay, three-pack of necklaces. Okay, okay, so these are the two-pack. What? Looks like a four-pack to me. Oh no, they're red, white, and blue with pearls in them and you get two. I wanna wear this as a bracelet and be like a patriotic Madonna for the day. It's really funny. And then they have three pieces here that say USA. And then they have three pieces here that are stars. Oh my gosh, these are fun. I love things like this. This is really interesting. I feel like you could put this in a wreath as well, like string it through your wreath if you are an avid wreath maker. We've already seen these awesome drink cup necklaces. So many goodies. I love these sunglasses. I think they're fantastic. But what I'm really psyched about, well, if you're looking for the light up cups, they've got them at College Point. And these, I love the utensil caddies. They made them in red, white, as you guys can see, and blue. And I'm gonna take one down so you could take a good look at it. I'll take the white one down. The white one is, so good. It's good for year round, guys. You could put napkins, you could put forks, knives, spoons, you could put whatever you want in here. But I think that they're good for so many other things like in your craft room or whatever you could possibly imagine putting in there. They would be great for it. They're sturdy and nice. And I am seeing these two packs of ornaments again, which we've seen before, but they brought them back and they're metal and we love that. And they come in blue with the wood beads, that's what they look like, the white or the red. They have the fringe backdrop in red, white, and blue. That's really nice. 12 latex balloons for a buck 25 is also a good deal. They have these little shot cups in red and blue, 20 pieces for a buck 25. I love the bunting. I shared with you guys the door banners that I think are just marvelous. Oh, the wind socks look better quality than ever. Look at the size of it. Do you guys see that? Star stripes, it says. It's really cool, actually. They're really large. Oh, then they have a gnome one. They have a gnome one, of course. They're never, never not gonna make gnomes for the 4th of July. I've accepted it. Hooray, USA. And then they have the wind spinner. See that? With the gnomes on it as well. There's another windsock, America the Beautiful. Do you guys see it with the gingham plaid? So beautiful. And Liberty, ooh, this one's really nice. It's very like vintage, rustic looking, really cute. Lots of awesome patriotic stuff. Oh, they have the garden flags. This one says America the Beautiful. And again, it's the gingham plaid. That's pretty. Here's the other one that says Liberty. I kind of love this one. It has 
See that? I love that print, the bandana print. Oh my gosh, I love it. They have this God Bless America sign and this home sign. Wow, the home sign is nice. Has a three-dimensional hat on it and let freedom ring with all that glitter. I love that shape, that's nice. I see that they made these bowls again this year. I hope they make the teal ones again because that is what I use like every day in my house as my kitchen go-to bowl. It's called the Handy Tub. It comes in red, white, and blue. And hopefully we will be seeing those in teal so I can replace the one that I've had for a year. Fingers crossed. They also brought back these and people love to buy these up and make Christmas gift baskets out of this. So good. And the white. I mean, you can always embellish them and make them Christmas baskets in any color. Just know that I've never met a solar light that I didn't like. Oh, this one's already lit up for us. What? Oh my gosh. How did that happen? How does it? Oh, somebody took the thing out. Look at how cool these are. It's very bright and they kind of remind me of the movie Aliens for some crazy reason. Aren't they cool though? Those are like a spotlight for a buck 25 guys. These are awesome. Really cool. Yeah, yes, absolutely a must pick up at the DT guys. Of course, we've seen these already. These are the spotlight that shines down so you can showcase maybe some plants or something that you're growing, but this one is really cool. It's definitely new and it looks really interesting. It says bubble sold separately, but it's called a bubble shuttle. I mean, I feel like kids are gonna get a kick out of just even figuring out how to put this together. I don't get, I think you step on this. Oh yeah, you step on it. I don't know, I think we're gonna have to test this out. It looks really fun keep seeing these and keep forgetting to record them because I think that it makes me super sad that I can't have them. Pretzels are my favorite, absolute favorite snack, but they have a new flavor of these pretzel sticks that we had like the cinnamon sugar, the peppercorn ranch, and there was one other flavor, something garlic Parmesan, I think. These Pop Daddy pretzels, bold snacks, made with big heart, smoked Gouda, hand seasoned in small batches. And I just saw Sweet Sadie J eating them. And I was like, oh my gosh, I haven't even recorded though. They look delicious. And then when she showed them, I was like, they do look like they have flavor that's so bold. It's lip smacking and finger licking goodness and crunch. So if you are not gluten or wheat allergic, definitely grab some of these because they look good, guys. But they do have some more of the garlic Parmesan. So I guess they brought in, because the other ones had expired, I guess they brought in these flavors again, peppercorn ranch, garlic Parmesan, and the Gouda one. And I'm seeing this cheddar jalapeno skinny pop, pure popped perfection, 47 calories per cup, non-GMO. It is a one ounce bag only, but it's made with real cheese. I'm going to try this for a buck 25. It's no artificial flavors, non-GMO and gluten-free. I'm down. Some new books that I have not yet seen or haven't seen in a very long time. The World According to Fanny Davis, My Mother's Life in the Detroit Numbers. Looks like a really good book. A triumphant tale of female empowerment. Bridget Davis's love letter to her mother lights a bold new path because sometimes leaning is not enough. Huh, this looks really good, honestly. Food Fix, how to save our health, our economy, our communities, and our planet. One bite at a time, best-selling author of Food, What the Heck Should I Eat? Sounds good to me. And then, really good to me, this is such a cute book, guys. Success, Napoleon Hill, Discovering the Path to Riches. And there are lots of quotes in it, but it's a really, really interesting book. A selection of Napoleon Hill's life-changing principles in a single volume. The writings and wisdom of Napoleon Hill have transformed millions of lives, making him one of the most influential authors on personal success ever. This is really cool, and it's very small and consumable. Look at this yellow lemon print. It's the prettiest fan I've ever seen at the Dollar Tree. 
They also have the fans in the cherry print. Do you see what I'm seeing? These are cherry print. I love them. Oh my gosh, pineapple. I love these. I think I love the watermelon. I, I don't know. I love the lemon, the water. I love them all. I am seeing the gorgeous iridescent glasses. This is the second time I'm coming across them and they don't have too many, but if you guys hurry, you may be able to snag some. Oh my gosh, I have been watching people show these for months and I don't think I've ever seen this exact configuration. It is called Tropical Escape. Instead of having two candles in it, there are four. It says that they are tropical cocktail inspired candles and in this package, it says that they are mini size but mighty scented and they are. I can smell them down the aisle. 100% cotton wick. They have palm wax blend, approximately six hours of fragrance per candle. And then I'm trying to figure out what the fragrances are. Look at that, it has a flamingo, I love it. Absolutely love it. Okay, and on this side, it tells us the fragrances. The tropical cocktails are kiwi, mojito which is infused with kiwi mint and lime oh my gosh mango iced tea i can smell a tea flavor oh my gosh it's so good you guys these are amazing notes of mango and black tea then we have cherry pop it says fun bubbly black cherry wow and then the last one is bland mimosa i was stumped on the last one i thought it said bland mimosa but it's island mimosa what a dingling i am sometimes <laughs> refreshing lemonade with a splash of watermelon obviously island mimosa not bland there's nothing bland about lemons and watermelon wow guys these are amazingly cool look at the beautiful colors they match all of the goodies that are in the Mother's Day collection that we're seeing everywhere. I'm actually currently in the West Islip store. I just ran in here. It's really late at night and this is the only new item in the store, but their display of the Mother's Day stuff is by far the nicest and cleanest and they added this to it and it looks amazing. I mean, these really will pull an entire look together. They've got the socks, the candles, they did a beautiful job. This store is always just amazing, amazing, amazing. And I do see they brought back the little mini lip glosses and lip stains that we had during the holidays, but in the beautiful packaging for Mother's Day. Look at this, guys. This is a new item here at the Dollar Tree. It's kind of funny, but I think it also might be useful. It is a decoy security doorbell. So it looks like you have a camera at your door. Now I know for a fact that people are going to use these at the holidays to have the kids think that the elves are recording everything they do for Santa. This can become a Santa cam for sure, for absolute sure. But on, on a completely realistic level, who's going to know that you're not using a real security camera in the front of your house? It does not include batteries. You need two AAA batteries. It has a constant flashing red light that's always on the doorbell lights up and makes a sound when pushed it comes in the black and it comes in the white it's easy to install no wiring needed so that's pretty cool guys for a buck 25 this is definitely better than that other little round ball that we used to have now this looks believable I do still have the window and door alarms here at the dt that actually make real sound and really do scare away people so you know, these are actually good, small, inexpensive precautions to help and protect your family. Wow, guys, I am finally seeing the Lucky Charms family size sweetened corn puffs. Do you know that Lucky Charms are actually gluten free and I could technically have them if I wanted to, which is kind of exciting. This is a family size for a buck 25. You can't be. I don't want to say that it's gluten free, but it doesn't have any wheat products. I'm not sure if it's appropriate for someone who may have celiac disease. It is so cool. I've never had these. It looks really awesome to me. I've never ever had these and they have a ton of the Lucky Charms and I am seeing just a couple of the Tres Leches Cinnamon Toast Crunch Cereal, which I know that I can't have 
they only have a few left on the shelf, but this is also a really great buy. I can't have it, but that doesn't mean you guys can't. Be on the lookout for these guys. These are an absolutely fantastic deal. But I think I am gonna treat myself to a box of the Lucky Charms because there's not a lot of things you can have when you can't have wheat. So corn puff treats sounds good to me. That's it guys, have you guys found anything amazing lately? Leave a comment down below and don't forget to like this video and please make sure to share it with your friends and subscribe. Stay safe and stay savvy guys, bye bye.